today's video, I'm going to be sharing what my 2024 spring favorites are. The collections that I'm going to be sharing in this video, they actually are under my swatch review playlist on my YouTube channel if you're interested in seeing videos on those. So the first thing is going to be this 6x6, six six, I believe is a measurement of these pieces of scrapbook paper. I got these specifically for like spring and Mother's Day nail art and I have been using these a ton. I got these for individual nail photos as well as YouTube shorts and YouTube reels and I am, or Instagram reels and I'm absolutely loving them. Next up is these little sticky tabs that you can adhere false nails to your natural nails with. I actually saw one of the nail techs that I follow on YouTube and Instagram say that these are really good for when you're making false nails because you can reuse them over and over and over again and just attach them to the little nail stands that you're using. And since I do nail stands a lot in my YouTube videos, I decided to try them out and they work amazing. I am loving these and I have been reusing them a bunch. So next up is going to be for a few stamping plates. And this one here, I believe was in a Valentine's Day uh, stamping plate set that I got. And I love this stamping plate. I love the abstract floral images and it has a lot of really good images for spring and for summer. This is going to be definitely shown in a lot of my videos coming up here. Next up is a swirl stamping plate and I actually got this stamping plate because one of my favorite nail designs to do is swirl nails and the problem with the other swirl stamping plate that I love is it's no longer available so I can't link it. So I wanted to get a stamping plate that was similar to that that I actually could link uh, for my videos as well. So next up is going to be this hand cream from EOS called Fresh and Cozy. That is the scent. And I love this hand cream. I am very sensitive to strong fragrances or hand creams in general. And so far, I've actually not had a problem with the EOS hand cream smells. They are amazing and I love them so much. And they smell amazing. So for polishes, the first one is Vintage from Orly, and this is an absolutely beautiful, I'm going to say like a honeydew melon pastel green. This was actually recommended to me from someone who wanted me to do a comparison, and I love this color. I've worn it, I think, so far twice on my toes now. I love it. This is a color that I'm going to get a ton of use out of for, obviously, the rest of spring as well as in the summer. This is definitely going to become a staple in my uh, collection. Next up is a stamping plate or stamping polish called Unicorn Horn. And this is an absolutely beautiful metallic chrome purple. I actually um, am not going to use this for stamping. I'm going to use this on my own nails because I've heard people say that you can paint your actual nails with stamping polish because it's more opaque. And I'm interested to try that out. I have not yet had a chance to wear this on my nails yet, but I'm very excited to do so very uh, soon here. And this color is just absolutely gorgeous. And of course, the name is very fitting. So next up is actually most of the polishes from the Orly 2024 Spring Collection. I did a whole swatch review video on my channel for that. This collection was absolutely beautiful. It had a lot of very beautiful colors, uh, colors that you can wear in the spring as well as in the summertime and obviously like all year round if you want to. I thought that the base of Vintage and that green one there was very similar. I love them. I've also been using the pink polish a lot in YouTube shorts, YouTube videos, as well as Instagram reels. And I love this collection. I thought it was absolutely beautiful. And the next collection is the Zoya Bloom collection, which was the spring 2024 collection. And I actually just did a whole swatch review video on my channel for that. I love this collection. It is gorgeous. So I'm not going to go into much detail about the collection because I do have a whole video on that as well as individual shorts for each of the polishes. I love this collection. I love the glitters. I love the creams. It was an amazing collection. So beautiful. And I'll have everything in the description box below. And that's it for this video.